have a story to tell today. I'm going to give you a little background about me and about how I used to um, totally not pay attention to my skin, right? And because as a black young woman, I was like, I don't need anything. I'm good with soap and water, blah, 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 blah. The problem happened to come along as I became a cosmetologist. It was young when it started. So when I realized that the things that I was doing to my skin wasn't good for preventative measures later. So I got really heavy into prevention over cure because usually what happens is people don't fix things until there's a problem and you see an issue arise. But sometimes I started noticing that even though we had the whole black doesn't crack adage and you've heard all of these other things what noticeably started to take place they, they gotta be kidding me what noticeably started to take place is that we started eating different foods there's a lot of chemicals in the foods there's a lot of sun protection that still needs to be happening and none of those things were happening so I got more educated more informed and realize that we need skincare that's the bottom line to the story so anyway i want to talk to you today about the virtual artistry app did i say that right virtual beauty app by artistry so they are probably one of the only people if not the only people that have this app that you can take a skin analyzation from your phone so how it works is that you would download the app and with you know, with, without guidance, you could just look at it and it will read your skin and it will tell you what's there, what's not, um, and how to address the issues, which is the best part about that. So we know most of the time you guys don't know what's up with your skin. You see a bump here, you feel like um, I get oily in my T-zone there, and then you make this whole half routine, and then you add makeup on, some of you, or some of you put lotion on, or some of you say, I don't need moisture at all because I'm oily. So I wanna kinda educate you on um, not so much only skincare, but today I wanna talk about the app, which I just told you, and I wanna talk about after you get your skin analyzed, what you can see. It tells you about your skin health, and your skin age two different things both very important because from that you can kind of gauge what's going on on the inside guys I'm all about beauty from the inside out even though we're working from the outside in you have to be mindful of what's gonna come out based on what you're ingesting the food and all of that but today we're gonna focus on this app the answers that it gives you right after you push analyze your skin it gives you a nice outline of products so here's the thing with that the product recommendations are going to be probably more than five items do you need all five items yes do you need all five items at the same time probably not so that's where I would come in or you know I'm like I'm saying me because I'm recommending y'all I don't know who else I'm gonna send you to somebody else to get recommended for It's virtual so you would call me right so after I would tell you which products to, to, to purchase how to purchase them and what order in which they can work for you the best at the time so that's the personalized piece like that's the part so after you know what to do with your skin what products you have you can treat anything right so for some of you it'll be preventative and it'll say all is well but still start with these products so that you don't create issues and then for some of you it'll say you have this you have that this 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 is how to correct it and I would give you a prescription when I say prescription I would show you how to gauge that so I want to talk about if you didn't use a virtual app which is not what this is for, but I'm still gonna tell you. If you don't use a virtual app and you're just guessing and you're not using a skincare system, but you have pieces of products, right? First of all, you wanna be using a skincare system, but if you're not, right, and you're just out here in the streets doing what you do, and you have a variety of products that you're trying to mesh together and with the prayer that they work the way they're supposed to, I'm gonna give you an order of importance of how they're supposed to work so that you won't come up with the end result that you're not looking for. The only reason we do skincare and we keep our skin lit is because that glow before, well, the glow that happens after you beat your face really starts from the glow of your skin prior. 
So you have to put on less makeup if you're a makeup wearer, if your skin is already tight, if your skin is already fabulous. If you're somebody who beats your face every day, you're a beat face queen, you're not going out without your skincare, great. But then what do you take your skincare, what, what, you're not going out without your makeup on, not your skincare, you're not going out without your bead on, right? What do you take that off with when you come home at night? For every person who does not take off their makeup every day that you put it on, and take it off properly it ages you 30 days it ages your skin 30 days which means that's why there's a lot of people that are older right now age-wise that are looking younger than a lot of younger women who are younger than them age-wise right so that beauty skin deep it really starts with in but then what you do to your skin once it's outside and once you know your performance or what you put on top matters so cleanser toner because the cleanser is the, the soap that's what you would be washing your face with right cleanser then you tone and then if you have a treatment product this is when you do treatment product that's the third step right treatment products would be eye cream under eye cream uh, to prevent wrinkles from ever starting to show up like there are no oil glands there So you don't you, you start to crease in there because the wrinkles come because the skin gets dried out And so we use eye cream for to prevent that from even happening like like we don't even need to go there and then Hmm I'm gonna pick a product of a, a treatment if you have dark circle dark spots not dark circles because that would be under eyes if you have dark spots if you have a lot of um, hmm, a lot of breakouts cause a lot of dark spots and that's based on a lot of food and just not cleaning out your pores properly. Um, so if you have those type of things and it asks you for a firming, a firming um, product so you can tighten your skin or to brighten back up your skin for the dark spots or exfoliate your skin whatever it is that third step would be you're doing a cleanser you're toning your skin to balance it and to give preparation for the skin to kind of receive the next thing you did your eye cream because that's a given and then what you're going to do that treatment product next okay and so if it's at night well i guess we should start with the day if you're in the daytime so you do the treatment product and then your next step would be a moisturizer might seem like a lot but it's not step one and two are very quick and three eye cream you'd put on your treatment product and your moisturizer moisturizer is usually the sealant it's the protectant it's the um end all to be all for the day you come out you um have your spf coverage going on and you're good to go right so if you do not do moisturizer after then you're going to kind of leave your skin abroad right at night though at night i would repeat the same process but depending on your skin uh issue that you're treating i might not add the moisturizer at night it depends though on and i'm talking about from my product for artistry i know what 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 to do with those lines because there are different properties and different skincare systems but they all co-mingle and it's easier to dissect it based per your skin per person because we're all unique guys at the end of the day and even if there was one thing for everybody you have seasons that change you had food that changes um what your body creates and comes out so we all gonna be different so based on that your order of process and procedure would be that way somebody asked me the other day so I put all of this stuff on and I don't want to wear makeup or I don't want to do that or I don't want to do great so use your cleanser you tone your moisturizer leave your eyes unprotected you don't need anything for a treatment then you're done but for preventative, you're just doing a cleanser, tone, and moisturizer. And then I would still say Secret Professional, maybe once quarterly or once a month for like your extra, like a nice facial just to exfoliate briefly. Or you could do exfoliation at home as well once a month, but like to give yourself a treat. Let somebody maybe clean out your pores deeply or get some of the go hairs or like little baby hairs off. Some people, sometimes like y'all are bugging out about, um, dark spots or like you see a shadow y'all know there's hair 
that is hair. That's like, it's called the nugo hair, like baby hair that comes when you first see these little babies first born. And sometimes you'll have it right along the sides of your face. Some people have it like a little mustache going on. And some people have beards. So you have discoloration based on hair follicles that are also sporadically placed all over your face. So, yeah, I have those. I got those little bunnies. I'm going to finish lasering. I'm doing a laser treatment because I'm tired of plucking. I developed a very bad habit of that. But anyway, um, so yeah, the Artistry Virtual app is amazing. We have modern technology that is available so you can see for yourself what kind of skin condition you have happening. And yeah, so anyway. That was it for the day, guys. Having a wonderful time. Figuring out that beauty app and get your skin right and drink some water.